We do know that processed food is the problem and real food is the solution. We know that the ketogenic diet helps and it's because it's real food. But the question is, what about the ketogenic diet is good? Is it because of the improvement in insulin sensitivity? Possibly, because lowering insulin at the level of the neuron turns out to be extremely important in terms of leptin and BDNF signaling, which I'll show you in a minute. Or is it because beta-hydroxybutyrate itself is a signaling molecule? It signals sirtuin activation. It signals mitochondrial biogenesis on its own, possibly. Or is it because the ketogenic diet actually clears sugar? There's no sugar in the ketogenic diet. And I'm going to show you the fructose directly, directly impairs mitochondrial function. And we also know that in the gut, certain bacteria, certain pathogenic bacteria, grow better with sugar. And so maybe that's actually increasing intestinal inflammation, leaky gut, as we heard from Ron DePatrick uh, on Thursday evening. Okay? So which is it? Kind of matters. Maybe different things for different people. You know, ultimately, that's where we have to go. We have to parse rather than lump.